taken me a while. I want to say it's been at least like 45 minutes maybe? I don't know. And um, so yeah. And the smoky fee, that's the product burning off. I've got that chi in there. My last layer of protection. Um, I've done it this way several times. I just did it like this a couple weeks ago and all my curls came back no problem. So, I really don't get too worried about heat damage um, because now I know which protectants to use and work for me. The, um, I think adding the Aphigy protein in there helps. But definitely too, making sure to deep condition and moisturize your hair and just keep it in good shape overall makes it so that it's ready for when you do things like blowouts and stuff like that. So this is the finished look. So, um, so ever since I started using the comb chase method I've always gotten it really straight like this but as far as it being lightweight um, the first couple times it was kind of heavy and like I said I was using shea butter to moisturize and so now I actually just wait to moisturize until after. And I'm just going to be using um, coconut oil. Um, so if you want to keep it pretty straight, straight, you can just wrap it at night. I like to do pin curls. So I'll kind of just show you how I would do. I would just take like a large section because I don't want it curly. Like if you make them smaller sections they're gonna get really curly and then I just take and wrap the hair around my finger like that like oh. so let's see if I can do that like that so I've got like a little curl and then I just kinda just lay it down flat like this and then I just take a pin and go like that. Um, so then in the morning, you know, I just pull them out and it, you know, it curls the front parts that I want to have curled. In the back, I usually take them and go under like this. And it usually kind of makes it flip up a little bit. So it isn't as straight as this. So like I said, you can always, um, wrap it and so when you wrap you know you just kind of wrap it all the way around um, and you can actually keep this I've seen people keep it flat iron for like two weeks if it's not humid and stuff like that um, I usually just keep mine for a week before I want to see my curls again before you start wondering oh my god are the curls gonna come back so um, this last couple months I've actually done it almost twice a month I think since because I've been doing some I've been just really checking on my ends and just sometimes giving myself a break because towards the end of the week I can just pull it all back into a ponytail um, or another really nice style like for the end of it when it's not like fly away um, you can do a braid out with rollers on the end and so those always look nice too so I hope you liked the video. So this is my length check for one year natural. 
So this is how long it is. And I have bangs now. So I mean, I've been cutting those all along because I have given myself heat damage in the past. Um, it was like the third time that I flat ironed when I was natural. And so, um, you know, I was new to being natural and didn't realize that you can't skip on the heat protectant. <laughs> Your hair just does not play. You skip it one time and it will let you know about it. So, um, I laid off of it for a really long time and so, but now I kind of know what my hair needs. So here's the back. And here's the side. And here's the front. So, so I hope this helped you. Um, if you were looking for a video about flat ironing, um, natural hair, it is possible <laughs> to flat iron naturally curly hair. Um, and my hair is pretty thick. So it's a little bit of a process, but you can do it. And if you have any questions about the flat iron that I use or some of the products I use and things like that, um, just let me know. Just leave me a comment down below or um, send me a question and just let me know. But that's everything that I use and the process that I use and it, it works. So I'll be doing, my next video is going to be about um, wash and go. So I'll be using Eco Styler Gel for that and the Paul Mitchell leave-in conditioner. So bye for now.